It's like all of Franklin Avenue Now sleeps upon my chest I'm new cigarette butts and loose leaf to build my nest What's going on, bitches? Yeah, so I just ate pizza and soda, so I just burped. Alright, so this is a standard Wi-Fi battle against um, this guy called Ash, and uh, whatever. So he has a Roserade lead, and so I had my uh, fly gone out. I didn't feel like taking a sleep powder, so I switched out. And Cresselia takes a Grass Knot to the face. But I don't know why I ate Grass Knot, because I'm fly gone, so it's not that effective. So, <clears throat> that's stupid anyway. So he withdraws, and he brings in a uh, Haunch Crow, and I decide to signal beam. And um, I clicked Signal Beam, and then I thought, no, I should switch to Bliss for the Stealth Rock. So now I switch to the Bliss for Stealth Rock, and it takes a Dark Pulse, which doesn't do too much damage. And I was like, okay, well, that's not too big of a deal, so whatever. But then he superpowers, and I'm like, ow, bitch. And that hurts a lot. And um, now I can get my Stealth Rock out, but I don't want to take another one of those. So now I go back to my Cress. So that's just one bad move, and if I had done something different, the match would have turned out differently. Anyway, so I take a superpower. It doesn't do much because I'm really defensive. And, um, I don't know if it's any if there's any difference between 50 and 100 level, but it seemed like my guys were weaker, so I don't know. Um, anyway, so I take uh, Dark Pulse, and, um, that's not good. I calm mind, and I thought that I would have been able to take it a lot better. I thought it was a, uh, I thought Honchko had way higher attack than he did special attack, but apparently he doesn't. So I bring in Heat Ran to take the Dark Pulse, and that does a lot of damage because it's a crit. And um, now I think I just um, uh, Flamethrower to try and kill this thing. And then he switches into, I, I don't remember something. Oh, an Entei, that's right. And um, so I Flamethrower the Entei, and I was like, ooh, if this thing does a lot of damage, but it doesn't. So I was thinking I might just go for it again, but then I was like, no, it's not even going to kill it, so screw it. So I go to uh, Cresselia, he stone edges, which would have been half against heat ran, so I, or uh, one times against heat ran, so I should have maybe just stayed in. And he gets a crit and kills the Cresselia, so now I'm back to the heat ran. And now I decide to ancient power because it'll kill the NT, and um, now he can't bring in Honchcrow. So, sort of goodness there, and um, now he brings in a uh, Metagross, which you'll see in a second. And... Um, I can't stay in because I'm stuck on ancient power because I'm scar uh, yeah scarfed, and so I have to switch out. <clears throat> and I believe I switched to my um, fly gun to evade, or no, maybe I switched to my Gyarados to evade the earthquake. And because I was thinking, okay, maybe I can set up. So that's what I do. And um, he earthquakes. And now I want to see if he has thunder uh, thunder punch. So I'm thinking about going back or going to my fly gun, but I think I go back to my uh, Metagross or my uh, Heat Ran so that I can um, do something. Okay, no, that's absolutely not what happens. I do go to my fly gun, but then he goes to uh, um, Militic, and it is Flame Orb, which I see, and I don't want to take, uh, you know, I don't want it to trick me, and then it gets a scarf, and then I get its, you know, Flame Orb or something. So I switch to Bliss, because, you know, f it doesn't matter if I get burned, because it has um, Natural Cure, but um, it, he uses Ice Beam, and I was like, okay, now he's going to Surf, but instead he packs Hydro Pump and I die, so it doesn't even matter and I just wasted my Blissey. And that just, that really sucks. So now I go to Jolteon and that thing finishes it off because it's choice spec And now he goes to, um, his uh, he goes to his Swampert and that's ground and I'm like, oh my god, just my luck. And I have nothing to take out Swampert and that thing will cost me the game. So I go back to my Water Phoenix just to get an Intimidate on it and... You know, I wanted a um, Dragon Dance, but I figured he would roar. But instead, he switches. So if I had Dragon Dance, it probably would have been a much different battle. Oh, whatever. So I went with the Waterfall, and it does a good amount of damage, but I know I can't go first next time because it's probably Scarfed. Otherwise, why would he switch it in? And so I go to my Heat Ran, and it takes the Thunder Punch and lasts with 10 HP, which is major. Because now I can get rid of the Metagross with Earth Power, and then I can... Uh, then he goes to his Honchkrow, I believe, and then I can switch around and get rid of that thing. So that's what happens, and the Metagross goes down, and in comes the Honchkrow. Yeah, because it's flying, and it makes everything evade. And I was so sure Stealth Rock was going to kill it, and then it didn't, and I was like, oh my god, you lucky bastard. And so now I have to do something, and I just let my Heat Ran die so that I can get my, um, uh, 
Gyarados in, I believe, and it's all it also kill he kills himself with Life Orb. So that's good. <clears throat> Brings his Roserade in. And I bring in my uh, Gyarados, and so um, I stay in when I shouldn't have. I should have switched so something else could have uh, been put to sleep, but instead he puts me to sleep. Um, I was thinking, my thought process was that he probably doesn't have sleep, otherwise he would have used it at the very beginning, but he does, so it's a moot point, and my Gyarados is worthless. So now I have to switch to Jolteon, because it has Bug bu or um, Signal Beam, which is going to be super effective. But he uh, grass knots and doesn't doesn't decide to stay around for the uh, the beam, and goes to Swampert. So I sing signal beam that, and it just does like one fourth health. So I'm like, oh my god, I have nothing to kill this thing. So I go back to my Gyarados now, and he uh, uses ice beam because he suspected I would bring my Flygon in, and he gets a critical hit with the ice beam, which, I mean, that's the end of Gyarados now because he'll just ice beam me again, and that's it. And now I'm stuck with Flygon and Jolteon, and there's nothing I can really do. I have no grass, and Ice Beam's just going to one-hit KO the uh, Flygon. And so I just went with Shadow Ball, because that was like my only option. Um, and he goes with Earthquake. I thought maybe he didn't pack it on the off chance, but he does. And so Jolteon goes down, and then Flygon comes in, and he just gets KO'd by the Ice Beam. So that's the match, and if I'd done any number of things differently, uh, or if he had just missed one of his crits or something... Um, would have been a very different battle, but whatever. Still good. Props to him, and uh, good game. Catch you guys later. Peace.